Howdy there. This is Mikey and Lola, the big blue van. Um, today is chore day. It's been a little, little past due. So I'm going to take you with me on this ride. Let's go. Okay. So there's a few things that need to happen on this list. The first is make the bed. So let's do that. Okay. There it is. Very simple, very easy, done. So now what we have is the dishes. It's my second to least favorite thing to do. And we've got a few to do. So let's get cracking. So the dishes I can't imagine are gonna be too exciting for you to watch me do. So I'm gonna speed things up for you while I take care of this mess. So here's a perfect example of chore day in a van. I get all these dishes done, sure. But then I realize I have one more pot and a lid and a fork. But here's my problem. I'm pretty much out of water. So we're gonna have to make do with a little bit of water I have left in that tank right there, put it into that one. And so I'll have to show you how I fill up my water too, which ain't a bad thing. Okay. So, we ran out of water. Not a big problem. Take my filter out. You just have to take off the lid of one. Easy enough. Pull it out. That's the water we're using right now. And then I have a mostly empty tank here. Just take the lid off of. And then just ever so carefully make do and fill her up. You know, sometimes you just run into these little problems that make van life hard. It really isn't. Just fill up the water. Okay, I wanna show you guys a quick tip. So in the bottom of this pan are some crusty bits from cooking the night before. Now it'd be easy enough to just put it in the sink and scrub it off, but it's gonna be a heck of a lot easier if you just put a little bit of water in there, put it on this cooktop, and then heat it up, get it to a small simmer. It's gonna release everything from the bottom, just like that, and it's gonna make cleaning it a heck of a lot easier. In addition, I wanna show you how well this little system works. So this vent fan, it, goes out into the cab and I just opened up a window, cracked it in there, and then I turned on my max air fan to blow air in. And so it's pushing all the air out through that exit. And so it's sweeping up all the steam and all the smoke and pushing it out there. And I don't know if you can see that, but it is pushing it that away, which is pretty cool. Okay. So after all of that is done and all the clutter is gone, um, I just like to take a clean dish towel, damp it up a little bit, and wipe down all the surfaces and sweep the floors. So that's what I'll do right now. And now we sweep the floors. I've made myself presentable to the public. Um, I'm not driving right now. Um, people that drive and film in these big vans, just don't, I don't know, be careful at least. Um, one of the last things I do for chore day is uh, fill up the water if it needs to be done. And today it does need to be done. And so I want to take you along with me uh, so you can see how that looks. Well, hi there, we made it. Um, Fred Myers, you can't see it. I don't know why I thought you would see it, but we're here. Let's go get some water. Still kind of full, still kind of full, still kind of full. Oh. 
Now the tricky part. You know what, screw it. I'm not doing it with one hand. Okay, ta-da, done. So doing water is my least favorite chore. I hate, I, I hate doing water. It's not that it's hard, it's easy. You just get the water and just, you refill it, but it's just a hassle. It's silly, but it's a hassle. It's done, it doesn't need to be done for another few weeks. The reason I use that filtered water station is because I do drink my sink water. I use it for cooking and everything. And I just wanna make sure it's clean water. I'm fine paying the few bucks it is to, to fill it up. Um, I may be a poor college student, but I can afford water. And it's, it's just every few weeks, so I'm not concerned. Well, thank you for coming along with me on my chores today. Um, it's been a blast and a half. You might say this has been a sort of day in the life in video as far as chores go. I'm planning on uploading every weekend as long as it doesn't get in the way of classes and work. I really hope you liked the video. I hope it gave you a little bit more insight on how you do chores in a van full time. And if you did like the video, don't forget to like and subscribe for more content like this or better than this. <laughs> For my next video, I'm planning on doing a Q&A for van life, chores, or van life in general. So if you wouldn't mind posting down below in the comments what sort of questions you would like answered, and I'll do my best to answer those for you. And as always, please have a wonderful day.